will be. Three wide into three. Cabarol in the 20, pushing the fact, and the 8 of Sammy Smith has to check up, and he falls back a few spots. That was a, one of those decisions we talked about, Rick. Sammy Smith in that 8 car, he could have just gotten really mad and got super aggressive right there. In a must-win situation, it's easy to let it get away from you. He did not do that, and now he still is out there with a shot. Big defensive move by that 2. Goes down and blocks the 20 of Almirola. See Love, now he's going to protect the bottom. You see that low exit, and just like that, they're stacked up behind. A lot of defense to the bottom. The preferred lane is right around the curbing, right around the bottom of the racetrack, and that's why you're seeing these odd moves down the straightaway to try to get to the bottom. Everybody wants to win this race. There's only two that are comfortable as far as making it into the championship four, and that is A.J. Allmendinger and Austin Hill in the 21. We see him there. He's already been a little aggressive with the 20, put the bumper to the back of the 20 a couple times. Yeah, I think what happened there is that Almirola, he got really aggressive when they dropped the green flag and put some people in some tough spots, and Austin Hill didn't like it. I didn't know it. Curbing on this racetrack, very difficult. As drivers on that inside line, if they get that left side front tire up there on the curbing it could shoot them out into the guys on the outside of them and yeah, look what happens right here racing for the bottom of the racetrack you like you you talked about it sheldon creed got back to the bottom and as soon as he got there went straight to it not letting anybody else get underneath him there's cole custer he's working by sammy smith now sammy smith stuck on the outside no opening for him right now Riley Herbst is going to fill the hole behind that double zero of Cole Custer. So Riley Herbst in the 98 trying to move up as well and not allow the eight in. He's still down there. Sammy Smith talked about it in the pre-race. Felt really good about his race car. Qualified seventh, but already back to 11th. Herbst is going to go by. Now here comes Sam Mayer. Sammy Smith continues to fall back. All the playoff drivers are nervous because it happens so quickly here at Martinsville. Look at this right here, the 38 of Matt DiBenedetto as they roll down into turn one. The outside lane stacks up, nothing wrong with bang, into the back of the nine, damage to the hood. The hood now kind of buckled up in front of the windshield of the 38, so it's been an uphill battle. Here are the 20 of Almirola. He was blocked once by Jesse Love. He was patient, but now he's on the inside. Love in that second line, and Almirola fighting to sweep the Martinsville races. One here in the spring. 